John, it feels like you're getting everybody's best shot. They came out pretty hard against you, but you played a very methodical, almost clinical game. Agree? Yeah, I, I thought we played a, a, a stiff game away from the puck. Uh, we really, single digits and scoring chances for them, uh, I believe. Two or three at the end there, uh, it probably a handful before then. So I, I like the way from a, a coach's point of view and where I think we have uh, been a little inconsistent, we were really good away from the puck. Uh, and played a good, other than a few minutes in the second period, I thought we were a little disjointed. I thought we were solid right on through. John, the power play gives you the spark, but it, it, is it the five on five play that allows for success in, in games like this? Maybe what you were just no, referencing? No, I thought the power play was a big reason why I was successful tonight. I, 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 I thought Edmonton uh, uh, had some good sticks. I, I, we developed some offense five on five, but, but the power play, you, you can. You can almost sense it a little bit when, when they go out there that they feel like they're going to score. I think our bench feels that. And uh, uh, so that gives us some momentum. And I thought it, uh, especially the second one, it springboards us into, into playing just a, just a solid game. It wasn't, much fa it wasn't fancy. It wasn't wide open. Uh, but we played a really good game. John, for those who uh, wonder who you guys are, tonight was exhibit A in a lot of ways. Would you agree with that? As far as what we are? Yeah, I mean, it, it, the depth of forwards, the way yeah, the defense keeps scoring chances down, good goal you never know where the winning goal is going to come it, from. It's who we are if we're going to remain competitive. Uh, I think you can get wrapped up in, uh, in the scoring. And listen, listen, I want our team to score. Uh, I think it's a league starving for scoring. It's great this year. A lot more goals are, are being scored. But when you get to the, to the real stuff, if you have an opportunity, uh, that stiffness and that, uh, uh, I guess, dedication towards playing away from the puck is, and consistency is very important. I thought we had that tonight. John, William Carlson slots in on the power play unit where he not usually is at. You probably weren't involved in the decision there, but was it exciting to yeah, see him come? Who do you think makes the decisions behind that bench? Well, usually you, I mean, Lars, you know, <laughs> takes over a little more. I mean, of course you were involved in the decision, John. <laughs> Tell us what went into that decision, how exciting it was to see him capitalize. It, it, for Bill, it was great because Bill, Bill did a lot of work uh, on the other side of a penalty killing. Him and Calvi have done a great job there. Uh, he was the next one up and uh, with Doobie in the box, and he looks like he's pretty comfortable there. Uh, uh, I'm, not, I'm still going to stick with Doobie. Uh, I think Doobie does some good things there too, but uh, for the amount of work that him and a guy like Calvi and Josh Anderson, the work they do away from the puck to get an opportunity in the power play and score and look like he knows what he's doing uh, was terrific. And that, that's one thing with Bill, and, and I think that's the next step. And, and I think Winnie has really done that, is Winnie is just confident that he's a scorer. He, he's going to bring some offense. Bill has it too. He just needs to, I think he's probably a year behind Winnie and understand I can do this also offensively, not just the defensive stuff. And uh, that's going to make us even a stronger team when he takes that next step. I think it's sort of indicative of how your whole season's gone and the, that Carlson scores that goal when he's out there and he's in, the, in slotting in for Dubinsky. Just how many different players have contributed to yeah. all of this? Yeah, I, I look at the sheet. Everybody was in double digits as far as time on ice. Uh, uh, 12 minutes, 11 minutes, uh, sometimes 14. I, I think the, uh, I think the team feels good about that. That they feel like everybody's contributing, and uh, it, it's it's kind of a lesson learned for me in in, in my career. Where at, at times I think I had an opportunity to play my fourth line more, and I decided not to. I've seen the other side of it here. And, and where they've been involved, and it, and it really brings in a little bit of a tightness into, into a unit. Uh, so it, it's right now, I mean, we're winning games. Everything feels good right now, you know. So, uh, but they deserve it. Uh, I'm proud of the team. I, I, I'm uh, really happy how they've handled these past three games uh, with all the talk and, and all that. And it, it, it's, a, it's a good test for them. That's one thing about it. I'm not really too interested in all, all of it being talked about, but they, they care about it. Those are the most important people that care about it, and it puts them in a spot to, to push themselves through and, and play with that type of pressure, I guess, right now in January.
John, on that point, are, are you surprised this hasn't gotten good to them, as you like to say? No, no, I, I think we, <laughs> we do a lot of talking about that. Uh, um, th there's been times uh, throughout this streak here, I guess, that uh, it looks like it's getting away from us, but I, I think that's a big part of the maturity of the team, that it hasn't. I, I don't, like I said the other night, when, uh, when they score a goal at the beginning of the third period out of mini, our bench didn't, didn't hiccup once as far as their attitude, as far as what they needed. There was no panic. That's a huge step that I think we've taken with this team. We're going to have more opportunities to get that tested when things aren't going well for us. Uh, I thought we answered it really well the other night, and hopefully that continues to grow. Because the sample size is growing, is your confidence in them growing? Do you now know what you have, as those guys alluded to earlier? Uh, I don't know. No, you know what? I'm not going to tell you anyway. I, I'm just, I just, I just want us to keep our head down, and I just want us to play. Uh, we know what we are. We're a, a, a group of businessmen, as far as I'm concerned, and I, that's where I think they have really grasped. Is they've accepted the the thought of coming to work every day and worrying about that day, playing that game and worrying about that game, not worrying about what happened not what's ahead of us. I, I, that's, where, that's what we are right now, is uh, uh, we're becoming pretty good pros, I guess is what I'm telling you.